Lisa Smith, former member of the Irish Defence Forces, left Ireland for the Islamic State, but she now wants to come back, claiming she's done nothing wrong. What did I do? I just joined the Islamic State and now I become a monster? I'm not asking to come home to blow anyone up or to do anything. For me, I, they don't have to fear. They don't have to worry about me, you know. Now, the government has accepted a responsibility to bring her home. Uh, that was back in March, but it's August now and plans have still to be made and she remains in Syria. Many people here at home are not exactly believing every word she says. I absolutely fully accept that and I can, I can say both I and, and Lisa's family are unequivocally clear as to the danger and, and absolutely appalling acts that ISIS have carried out. However, we must remember the starting point here. The starting point here is that this murderous organisation tend, tendencies and modus operandi is to ensure that they radicalise foreign women and bring them to the Islamic State. The reality is, and we cannot forget, but the, that there is, uh, at the heart of this, a child who is absolutely innocent of any crime. There is a woman who has been radicalised uh, in some shape or was form she a by is she a murderous victim? Is she a group. victim of ISIS rather than somebody who was perpetrating and, uh, and spreading their message? But the, the reality is that we would say, uh, at the, the starting point here is that there is evidence that she has been a victim of radicalisation, right? The second issue is that, as it stands, in, in, in assessing whether Elisa is a threat, she would be a greater threat in Syria than she would be in Ireland. And thirdly, what we would say is that the, the, the Irish uh, authorities have the requisite powers to conduct an effective investigation to ensure that if Lisa has committed any acts of criminality, she can be investigated for those and she can be prosecuted for those. The difference, however, is she would be prosecuted by, by way of a fair trial in her home jurisdiction.